Hi everyone. Today, we're gonna to use our counting stick to practice our three times table. I've got my counting stick here with all the multiples of three attached to it at the moment. So we're gonna start by counting together forwards and backwards in threes. Are you ready? Zero, three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. Let's try and go backwards. 30, 27, 24, 21, 18, 15, 12, 9, 6, 3, 0. Are you ready to try on your own? I'll point to them and I want you to say out loud, we're going to go forwards and backwards. Are you ready? Ready to go backwards. Great job. Now we're ready to start doing it as times tables. So I'll say the times tables and I want you to say the answer. Are you ready? Zero times three. One times three. Two times three is three times three. Four times three. Five times three. That one is gonna stay in the middle. Six times three is seven times three. Eight times three. Nine times three. Ten times three. Great job. Now I'm going to change the order a little bit. See if you can say the answers after I say the number sentence. Four times three is Two times three is, seven times three is, 10 times three is, one times three is, zero times three is, five times three is, eight times three is, nine times three is, zero times three is, Great job. Now I'm going to start to take some of these off to really challenge you. I'm going to take away zero times three, because you all know that's zero. I'm going to take away one times three, because you all know that's three. And I'm going to take away 10 times three, 30. I'm going to put those away. Are you ready? Remember to say the answer. Zero times three is, one times three is, 10 times three is, Six times three is, four times three is, two times three is, nine times three is, eight times three is, three times three is, seven times three is, and five times three is. Fantastic. I think we're ready to take a few more off. Let's take away. Two times three is six. Let's take away three times three is nine. And let's take away this middle one. Five times three is 15. Let's move those away. Okay, same again. Let's see if I point to one and say the number sentence. See if you can shout out the answer. Zero times three is, one times three is, two times three is, Three times three is, four times three is, five times three is, six times three is, seven times three is, eight times three is, nine times three is, 10 times three is. Well done, let's mix them up. Three times three. One times three. Six times three, five times three, eight times three, 
nine times three. I'm gonna take away the nine and see if you can remember that. Nine times three is 27. And I'm gonna take away the four times three. Four times three is 12. So we've got the whole of this side now is empty. I'm gonna leave you three more on there, probably the trickiest one. Six times three is, seven times three is, and eight times three is, okay. Two times three, four times three, five times three, zero times three, one times three, 10 times three, nine times three, six times three, seven times three, and eight times three. So finally, it's time for these ones to come up as well. Six times three is, seven times three is, and eight times three is, right, are you ready? Three times three is, one times three is, seven times three is, nine times three is, two times three is, eight times three is, zero times three is, six times three is, five times three is, 10 times three is. Let's put them all back on and see if you were right. Zero times three is, zero. One times three is three. Two times three is six. Three times three is nine. Four times three is 12. Five times three is 15. Six times three is, if I can find it, there it is, 18. Seven times three is 21. Eight times three is 24. Nine times three is 27. And finally, 10 times three is 30. Great job. And now I think you're ready for some final chili challenges. Here you go. See if you can try some of these on a piece of paper or in your home learning book. If you want to try one chili, you've got some of the ones you've just practiced. Two chili, can you work out what the missing numbers are in these number sentences? And three chili, you can really help me because unfortunately my counting stick only goes up to 10 times three, but really we want to know 11 times three and 12 times three as well. Do you know them or could you work them out? Pause the video now so that you can have a go and then play it again once you've had a go and we'll see the answers together. All right, how did you get on? Should we have a look at some answers together? See if you can say them out and I'll add them on in my pink pen. So for one chili, two times three was six. Four times three is 12. Six times three is 18. If you went on to chili two, did you work out what the missing numbers, missing numbers were in the number sentences? What times do you have to times by three to get to 30? Oh, I know, it's 10. 10 times three makes 30 because 30 has got three tens in it. What do you have to times by three to get to 21? Hmm. Six and three is 18. Ah, it's seven. And if I'm unsure, I could do the division, use my inverse to help me. 21 divided by three is seven. So seven times three must be 21. And finally, how did you get on with working out these two that weren't on the counting stick? The first one was 11 times three. Well, I know with the 11 times table that there's one 10 and one one. So if I multiply that by three, well, Three tens 
is 30. Three ones is three. So 11 times three must be 33. And then finally, if I want to work out 12 times three, I could just add three more to this because I know that's 11 times three, or with the 12s, you're fantastic at the tens, you're fantastic at the two times table, and 12, you could split into a 10, partition it into 10 and two. So 10 times three is 30, two times three is six. Put the math together, 12 times three, is 36. How did you get on? If you found any of them tricky, no problem at all. Well done for showing a good growth mindset. You can always go back to the start of the video and have another go on the counting stick to practice again. And anytime you feel like you need to practice, go straight to the start, get back on the counting stick, keep saying them again and again and again until they become stuck in your brain. Well done. And when you've had a good go at this one, maybe have a go at the four times table or the eight times table. See you soon.